lot more lovely and more temperate. That's his, that's his tattoo, by the way. <laughs> Whatever woman this way would, whatever woman this way won. I don't know what any of these words mean. I will now do a, sol a, sol sol a monologue from the greatest play. You got a big puffy white shirt on. <laughs> to be or not to be? That is the question, Steve. <laughs> But soft. <laughs> what light through yonder window breaks? It is the east, and a Vander Holyfield is the sun. <laughs> yeah, I was scared that night. I was scared. I really was. I just I pictured him walking to work that night, like nee, 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 nee. fucking tiger on a leash. Come on, Bob. Nee, 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 nee. Bob. <laughs> and he's like, what? Wait a minute. What did that sound? Ba 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 ba. That's the most beautiful thing I've ever heard. I gotta go check this out. I don't have a ticket, but who's gonna stop me? I'm fucking Mike Tyson. Look at that little white boy with the guitar. Thinking of, oh, that is just the most gorgeous. You son of a bitch. You're a dead man, Steven. I'm gonna eat your children, Steven. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck you till you love me, Steve. <laughs> Remember when he said that? Yeah, Lennox Lewis. <laughs> and, and by the way, given those two choices, I would let him eat my children. <laughs> I don't would. give a shit. <laughs> fuck them. Be like, Tyler, Taylor, you go with Mr. Tyson. But Dad. Go with nice Mr. Tyson. <laughs> oh no, Troy Cinnamon. <laughs> <laughs> Troy's back there, too. Mike Tyson! Let's kick his ass! Shut up, Troy. Like they know each other. Ah, <laughs> oh, Troy again. Tell Cinnamon I said, what's up? <laughs> uh, anyway. This is Mike first, everybody. He's going to play cello for us. I also still feel a little weird about using the word queer in that song. Like, is that okay or not? No, it's not, right? Well, but I'll tell you what, I was, I was trying to, you know, bring, I was trying to use it in the original sense of the word. You know, the old time, it's like peculiar or strange. For too long, that word, it's been the domain of the homophobes and the bigots of the world. I'm taking that shit back. Good right? for you. I'm restoring it to good its original for you. glory. Yes. It's about goddamn time. It's about time we straight white males shuffle off this oppression. I want to be able to use that word with fucking impunity anytime I want. It's bullshit. This next song is um, widely considered to be the most beautiful song ever written. And I wrote that shit. So fuck you, Train. Train? <laughs> I thought Train was the first shitty band that I thought of. I, oh, I fucking hate that band. Hey, soul sister. <laughs> Drops of Jupiter. What does that even mean? I'll give you some drops of Jupiter. I'll give you some drops of Jupiter all over your perfect fucking hair. Yeah, let me get in on this shit, Steve. What am I doing? Me and Mike Tyson are bukkakiing the lead singer of Train now. Can we cut all this out in post-production? I don't know what's more disturbing, that image or the fact that apparently you and Mike Tyson both named your dicks Jupiter. <laughs> That's a good point. If the shoe fits, Rod. What do you mean? <laughs> Mine does have a big red spot on it. So. You need to see the doctor. All right, here we go. Not a train song. The song's called, uh, Let Me Inside. Why did they laugh at the title of the song? Oh, all right, I get it. Because the thing is going to be about a vagina. It's not about a vagina. It's really about the dichotomy. It's about a vagina. No, it's not. 
Maybe it should be about a vagina. <laughs> be a better, you know what, fuck it. Tonight is gonna be about a goddamn vagina. I don't give a shit. All right, Rod. Courtney? Yeah. Where are we going? Kind of fucked up congressional hearing is this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, don't get too close to him. Oh my God. <laughs> you don't know what he's capable of? <laughs> giant. Oh! He's putting his big meaty hobo hands on her. He's stroking her hair, man. Oh. It's like a scene out of Of Mice and Men. <laughs> I can see the rabbits, George. I will hug her and pet her and squeeze her and call her George. <laughs> you have the most beautiful hair. <laughs> what have I done? I must eat ham. <laughs> Oh, still pissing off the hobo. All right, settle. Here we go. This show is off the rails. All right, let me inside. A song not about a vagina, except tonight. Partly about a vagina. <laughs> Show me your heart, will you open it wide? Expose the raw nerves, will you let me inside? Can you tear down the wall, for the mortar has dried? Will you show me your heart, will you let me inside? There's not to infer, and nothing implied. I literally mean, will you let me inside? I'm at your front door, it's not open, I tried. It's cold as balls out here, let me inside. You know when it's dark, I get terrified. Come on, seriously, will you let me inside? Think I just saw a possum all beady eyed. Those things fucking scare me. Please let me inside. Are you angry with me? Are you preoccupied? Are you taking a shit and can't let me inside? I can smell from the kitchen the food that you fried. I've had half of a power bar, let me inside. How can this situation be rectified? Hey, here's an idea, fucking let me inside. Tried to climb through your window, but I was too wide. You should get bigger windows. Or let me inside. Are you with a new guy? 